Hello and welcome to my channel Kodigo Maven. Today's topic is creating and deleting list from SharePoint online site using PNP PowerShell commands. First you can see I have already opened a Windows PowerShell IC and have already connected my SharePoint online site. If you are first time using PNP PowerShell then how to set execution policy, how to install PNP PowerShell module, how to connect to SharePoint online site, uh, what is this uh, use web login parameter all these details you will get in a prior video I'll give the link in the description box below so let's start so I have already typed the syntax is over here I don't want to waste time in typing so here uh, here is the command for creating a new SharePoint list in SharePoint online site so the command is basically new PNP list then title this title takes the display name of the list then template obviously you can create a, a document library also but here we are creating a simple list that is why the template we have chosen in generic list otherwise if I go delete it and check the intelligence you can see this many type of lists or document library you can create like discussion events everything everything is there but uh, we want to create a simple generic list generic list so i have uh, selected the template as generic list now this enable versioning will enable the version for this list whenever this list schema will get changed it will increment the version number by one then uh, this parameter uh, will show uh, our newly created list on the quick launch and then finally this url so if we don't give this parameter then also this list creation will work but what will happen is uh, the url of the list will be created as test space list but we don't want this display name can be test space list but url uh, if it doesn't take any special character or space it is better so we are using uh, test without space any and uh, and then list so uh, this is for formatting the url so now finally we can uh, run this command to create our list let's run this command okay so see uh, this has been cre uh, this has been successfully executed so let's open the browser and uh, here is our site we this is a communication site and we added uh, our site in quick launch that is why it is getting visible over here and if we click on this list see there is no space in the url section so uh, in spite of uh, the list name is having a space test space list but in url there is no space so url has been decorated beautifully after that enabled we have enabled a versioning so if we go to list settings versioning setting uh, so you can see versioning has been enabled so that is it for creating a new list in sharepoint online using PNP PowerShell. Now uh, there is a simple command for deleting this list using PNP PowerShell. So basically when we uh, run any PowerShell script we don't want any pop-up to come up. That is fine. We, I have used this force command otherwise if you don't use it it will um, open a pop-up box uh, and which will I'll just show you only. So here is the command for removing this test list we just created. We can give the display name over here uh, from SharePoint online site. So if uh, without the force command, if we run it, it will ask for confirmation. Then you have to uh, say yes or no or suspend. Uh, so uh, when we are running a bunch of commands together we don't want this side, uh, sort of 
लाइक डायलॉग बॉक्स टू ओपन इन बिटवीन इट विल पॉज आवर पॉज द रन ऑफ आवर एक्सिक्यूशन सो वी डोंट वॉन्ट इट वॉन्ट इट आई हैव यूज द पैरामीटर फोर्स सो नाउ if you run this command it will uh, delete this list without any pop now if we go and refresh our site see the test list has been deleted from the site so it is not there so that is it friends uh, uh, we have seen how to create a list and how to delete a list from sharepoint online uh, using pnp partial so thank you so much for watching Stay tuned for more videos like this. Thank you.